Today I am going to show you how to solve the traveling salesman problem using Excel solver. Here we have a 7 city distance matrix. So this will be a distance from the second city to the third city and similarly the other ones. So in TSP we have to find a sequence of city such that we start from one city and travel back to that city by covering the rest of the cities exactly once. So how we solve this using uh, Excel is like we will start with a random sequence. So this is the sequence starting from 1, 2, 3, it is up to 7 and then we will have to come back to the first city. So similar to this we have to find a sequence such that the total distance travelled is minimized. So we have to find the distance travelled from city 1 to city 2. This can be done using the index function. So index we have to search this is the distance matrix we have to select that one turn it into absolute then this is the row we have to find the distance from the first city to second city so this will return a value 34 that is first row second column Just drag it. Now we have to find the total distance. This will be the sum of these distances. And we got it as 192. Uh, this is just for a random sequence which is given here. We have to find the best sequence which can be uh, found using Excel solver. So in the data tab, you select Excel solver. So the objective is to minimize the distance. Select that one. Select the distance. And by varying this the sequence, by varying the sequence. And the constraint is we have to visit the one city only once. So this sequence every number has to be different. That you can give by selecting diff all different. And I'm using evolutionary solver because for large size problems evolutionary solver will give a much better solution. Here in the options, the maximum solution time is let's give 20 seconds. Okay, now if you give solve, it will give a solution after 20 seconds. You can stop. Uh, we have to, for this problem 159 is actually the optimum solution and we have got that solution using this evolutionary solver which is which is very easy and we can use it we can solve it using Excel which is uh, available readily with everyone. So thank you.